Hey guys, I'm Russell Vane, and welcome back to another episode of Guacamelee 2. Where we last left off was we, uh, basically are making our way to El Infierno. Uh, still butchering the name for myself. But yes, we're still making it, making our way to sort of like this hellish area. But the construction yard is literally blocking our way, so we're still making our way there. Um, nothing more, nothing less yet, so... Uh, no, I think I'm gonna get trampled on here. There we go. Uh, I need to get used to my controls again. I, I'm sorry if I'm trying to... I guess this is a good way to kind of remember the controls a little bit, I guess, maybe? Up there. I wonder why is it such a... I'm just looking at this fence of death and it's like... <laughs> it's still going. Oh, I know why. I have to like literally change the dimensions. I forgot about that. Alright, so that's how it works. I forgot about that for sure. That was like totally on me. Oh, no. Nope. Uh, let me do that again. There we go. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to get used to everything again. Wallfly and uh... Wallfly and the uh... I think that should be fine, maybe? Oh god, I can't even, like... There we go, I guess. Oh my god, I don't know if I can even make it. This is gonna be harsh. Yeah, it's gonna be harsh if I'm trying to get, get over there without having to... Yeah, because I can't wall run all the way up. What the heck? Oh, I might have been like wanting to. Alright, here we go again. <clears throat> Alright, here we go again. Oh, there we go. Alright. Okay, I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out how to pause myself. I wanna see how I pause myself. Because I cannot understand the idea. Okay, no, that's not how it works. Yeah, because if I press A, it cancels it, giving me a chance to, like, stop it. And then, uh, I would probably need to just be careful, pretty much. Okay, but let's do this again. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what the heck I'm supposed to do to cancel my wall run because it never t tutorializes or tells you how to cancel it. Instead, they just tell you like, "Hey, we got a thing." Uh... Oh, jeez. Yeah, I had to like. I mean, that's the hard part is just figuring out what to do to cancel my my wall run from pushing me all the way up to the top, um, but it doesn't let you, like, understand it, really. It doesn't fully let you understand what the hell you're supposed to do, I think. No. No! Ah, oh, son of a gun. Do it again. I think we can make it. There we go. Okay, I was so close. Oh, sheesh. Yeah, because if I jump... If I jump, uh, or if I double jump, it pretty much prevents me from, like, getting further in. Uh, <clears throat> like, it prevents me from, uh, going higher, it just makes me go lower. I gotta stop doing that a little bit. I gotta stop doing that. Get over there, quickly. There we go. Okay. Gotta be careful though. Okay, this one at least, <laughs> at least that much is given. At least, like that is, at least that wall, that ceiling thing is at least giving. Oh my god, I don't have a chance to to really take a breather here, do I? Oh no, no, I need to like switch dimensions. I was pressing that wall uh, wall run without thinking about it. No, mm, I'm. I'm not a fan of how, like, I can't grab onto the wall. 
and I can't do wall fly without having to like split off my my, my, my analog stick. What is going on, game? What do you want? What do you want? There we go. Sheesh. I don't think it's gonna make it, so... Ooh, that's a freaking very close one. Very, very close one. I'll take it. Oh, God. Oh, no! Mm, it's really tough because it's like... Okay, I'm not gonna do this right now. I'm gonna take it away for now. I'm gonna go off to continue with this stuff for now. I I wanna I don't wanna spend all my time with this episode trying to. Uh... Oh no! Ah, oh, okay. I was closing in on. I mean, at least I got it like, mostly done. There we go. Oh jeez. Okay. Come on. Okay, thank God. Okay. There we go. I'm not a fan of the the whole claw idea. Like this whole thing is kind of becoming a little bit weirder for me. A little bit. Uh... Oh come on, really? Okay, I needed that to be a little bit higher. Somehow, I needed that a little bit higher. I messed that up. I wanted to drop down, but I wasn't thinking about it. Right here. I think that should be good. Yeah, it's all about timing now at this point. No! Oh. I'm sorry, again, I, I am trying to remember all my moves. I don't remember all my buttons. I'm not remembering too much of my, my buttons. I've only remembered most of the... I only remembered most of the other stuff, which is like the basics. Like the wall run and the uh, wall fly are like pretty simple in my mind. Oh dear. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah, son of a gun. Get out of here. Oh god. There we go. Oh, son of a gun. Oh. There we go. There we are. Cool. Yeah, I forgot that the certain, like, hit combos will give you money at this point. So that's pretty good now, at this point, that I can just get as much money as I needed to. I totally forgot that was a thing. Totally forgot like how much how much distance we need to close on it before we can make it. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, that's so freaking tough. Timing is always all the key for this one, I guess. Like a lot of this is really just timing, which is really ridiculous. Oh god, that's not a great sign. This is oh this is a safe zone. A safe safe zone. Not saving zone, but like just safe. It's like super safe. Oh, okay. That, I think that provides enough room, I guess. A little bit. I'll have to be the hen for this one, the chicken. Oh, oh no! I just I landed in the right at like a really good spot and I just screwed it up for myself. Which is entirely my fault, honestly. Uh, oh, we got the man in there. No. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's a lot of room, so that's pretty okay, I guess. Yeah, there's enough room for me to, like, do whatever I need to do. I want to see where the, the, the gate stops so I can get close enough to move as quickly as I can here. Oh. Oh. No! Mm, I just... I just had it, because I, I had it with the timing, but it's just... Oh, my bad.
god. It's a challenge, but... I don't know why the challenge has to be this ridiculous, but whatever, I guess. Okay, here we go. There we are. So it reaches the other wall, and then we can just, like, do this. I mean, I'm... I like that this is new. Like, this is not the same sort of, like, kind of content that they created in the first Guacamelee. Uh, and that's totally cool. Like, they, they went and tried to do something, like, different from what they originally did. Because they're trying to make sure that they are doing something entirely new. I'm just like, I'm doing this because I want to be careful. I want to take a breather at least. There we go. I want to give myself a breather a little bit before I get into the madness of all that jazz. Oh my god. Wait. What am I supposed to expect from here? I just realized that's pretty, pretty bad for me. So if I change it, I have only a set amount of time to do the thing, right? There? No, mm, no, no, I'm almost there. I just need to be very, very, like, quick about it. Quick, quick, quick! Go, go, go! Okay, good. <laughs> Thank goodness, finally. Jeez, I made it over here for once. Alright, here we go. But yeah, it's gonna be a doozy for me to just get this. Lucha! Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a- wait, what? What? How? What? Oh, jeez. Oh, god. I'm trying to, like, keep up with the time here. There we go. Oh. I didn't mean to switch dimension. There we go. Gotcha. Oh, that was a close one, dude. That was a real, real close one. <laughs> Holy heck. I can't believe I did that in one try. I would not have believed myself if I did it in one try, at the very least. Sorry, I saw a fly. Or some sort of like, thing floating about. I would not expect myself to like really get that in like the first try. I thought I was gonna get that in like the next try. Next time. Okay, money. What is this? Where is this taking me? Oh, this is from the from the when we first That was like when we first got through the area and the, there was a block uh, being blocked off there. Yep. There we go. Man oh man. Alright, so we're still making our way to the top of El Fierno, so we're just gonna keep making it. I don't know why he's making me do that. Alright. Oh, it looks like a chicken dash to something? I wonder what that is. Oh, it's the- oh yeah, it's the super chicken thing. Oh yeah, the chicken thing that we can just smash into people. Oh my god, it's like interesting how you can just do this. It does remind me of the whole like, like the whole um, Mario Mushroom thing, I guess. It's just hilarious to me. Let me get rid of this. Please. Oh, there we go. I missed one, I know. I missed an enemy up there. Uh, is there more? Oh, there is more. Lucha! Oh, the combo's still going. The combo's still going. The combo's still going, ain't stopping. I just love how this one is like almost like, like you get invincibility in a sense. Like you get invincibility and it's really nice that they're doing this to let you kind of have fun at it instead of like making you just like wince at pain of like losing it. There we go. Cool. That was the first time for... Wow, that was a lot of money actually. <laughs> Let me see what the hell... I can actually upgrade a lot now. 
Oh my god, 15,000 is a lot. Yeah, because none of these don't ask- they don't ask for like more than 10k usually so far. Alright, we're gonna do that to get the whole thing there. Stamina cost 50%, which is nice. Okay, so we lost it all. We lost it all. <laughs> it's fine. Special moves cost no stamina after 100 hits. Okay, I'll take it. I think this one, the heavy hitter, is a pretty big one already. Yeah, I haven't done enough polo, polo slide to, to, to really gain that last bit. But I'm pretty sure we'll probably get the rest, hopefully. Just get the rest of the stuff, hopefully, soon. But time will only tell. Whoa! <laughs> the cactus shape is in the back of the the background where he just smashed through the freaking canyon. <laughs> we have cornered the evil vulture and his abomination, but the ancient weapon has been misplaced. Our victory is hopeless without the ancient weapon. Perhaps it was dropped in a previous room. Did you by chance encounter a large feather bestowing great strength to all who touch it? I just used it getting up here. Oh! You found the ancient weapon. Oh, you used it already. Oh. <laughs> well, uh, good luck. Right, right through the this hole here, please. Okay. So technically, we. I keep freaking. Why do I keep doing that? I keep thinking that pressing Y is the, the ability thing. Oh, it's not gonna let me go further. Fearless chosen one, you are confused. The bird who must not be named is through the hole just in front of me. Okay, so he's he's not gonna let you go through unless you start the fight against Cactus Vulture or Vulture and Cactus. I don't know what to call it, honestly, but whatever. All right, I don't know what to what to expect in this fight, but we'll see what happens. Wait a minute! How did you get here? I'm gonna read it like this from here on out. I'm I'm sorry. I I need to distinguish the chicken voices and the, the other vo voices that need to be different. And I sometimes mix it up, so I I do apologize if I mi missed out what the voice was. To be fair, I don't even know where here is and who you are. I think we probably think the wrong exit. We took the wrong exit at that last intersection. Before you spam X on us, know this. I really don't care about what the, that brute Salvador is doing. But he's helping me get a leg up on the chicken Illuminati. So if you're trying to stop him, you're impeding my plans. Cactorado, do you, do you still have the golden egg in your belly? I don't need to repeat that, that scream because he, they just gave it to me for free. Good, good. We must keep it safe. Man, that is a lot of saliva in the cactus. I'm wondering, okay, this is the weirdest thought, but I'm wondering if the cactus's saliva is the cactus juice, because I know cactuses have like liquids in them because that's how they're, they're uh, that's how they're, the plant is operating and in, in, in keeping themselves moist in the desert in a weird way, but. Yes, since these people are threatening the golden egg, we must defeat them. Uh-huh. <laughs> hmm, yes, let's do this so quickly so we can find our way out of this damned place. Capturado and Zope. Okay, so his name is Zope. Oh. Okay. Oh dear. Okay, that doesn't really matter. Oh god, this is really tough. Yeah, because of the bird. Ah, son of a gun. He does use a lot of the other moves that uh, are familiar with me. Oh! What? It's like the best possible way is like... Oh, I dodged out of it, but I still got damaged though. What the heck? There we go. Oh, how? How do I deal with the cactus? Uh, how do I deal with the cactus? Oh my god. Oh, I can't even understand what I'm supposed to do. What am I supposed to do with the cactus? The heck? <laughs> okay, we don't need the theatrics. We don't have theatrics. Yeah, yeah, let's skip over. 
Oh, there we go. <laughs> Oh, kind of really. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. Ah, oh, son of a gun. I mean, the pattern is normal, which is fine, but. Oh, God. No, I was like close. Oh, son of a gun. Oh, come on, dude. There we go. Oh, God. Do I just, just keep dodging, I guess? I'm sorry if I have to, like, if I'm not saying anything right now. Okay, let me think. Oh boy. Ah, son of a gun, I almost got through that. Oh, there we go. There we are. Oh, what? Oh god. Oh, oh jeez. There's actual enemies on top of it. Okay, I got it now. I'm getting it. I'm getting the hang of it. Okay, so the basic part of this boss fight, I don't have any clue what the hell I'm supposed to expect here until just now, is to knock the vulture off the head, but I need to wall fly through it to get him off the head. I do, I'm a, I do apologize if I go silent, but it's because this boss fight's a little bit more complicated than way Peck and uh, El Muneco. Both characters were like very sim simple and straightforward, I think, in my mind. But this one's a little bit more complicated, which I I, didn't, I mean it, it makes sense a little bit that they made the difficulty the way they did. It's like really not like it's not really understandable at first, I think, because of the way. Nope. Don't you there? Oh god. Oh my god, how did I thought how did I miss that? Oh, sheesh no I didn't I didn't dodge roll good enough. Ah It's all about timing man There we go There we go at least we got that one going Oh no that was bad there we go. Alright. Okay, there we go. Oh, boy. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh boy. That was a close one. Oh, no. I wanted to do wall run, but I couldn't do it. For the life of me, I could not do it for some reason. Okay, at least I got some health back on that. Oh no, oh. I can't even, like, get to pay attention. Please? No! Why is the wall run always so bad? Why is it so hard to, like, do it? Oh, son of a gun. The wall run is hard because it's, like... Because it's like, I have to like, pay attention to like, other stuff on top of it. Ah. It's because I'm paying attention to like, both the cactus moving, but, but, the flying monsters are also on top of that. But that wasn't the difficult part. The difficult part is not understanding why wall fly doesn't immediately happen whenever I try to pull the move on it. Um, because I know that I'm effectively throwing it out correctly, but then the problem comes down to... Uh, yeah, I, I mean the move comes down to like... Oh, oh no, okay. Alright, I'll take that. Oh! Get out of here. Oh, son of a gun. I forgot about that. Nope, don't you dare. 
Oh no. Oh sheesh. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh come on, really? There we go. Ah, oh, son of a gun. I'm trying to like get this going, but I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> Game, let me just have it. A little bit, little by little. Get out of here. Oh, son of a gun. Oh god. I'll get that, I guess. Oh. Oh, sheesh, now I'm back to this one. Okay. Oh, I gotta tr change over the chicken. Oh. Oh my god, I had to fight him as a chicken as well? How dare you, game? Oh my god, I can't even pull. Pull. Pull a slide! I can't even, like, begin to wonder why this polo slide has to be a thing. Oh, 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 come on, <laughs> really? I have to, like, legitimately, like, actually get him to... Oh my god. There we go. Oh, now we're back to this again. Oh no. Oh god. God. Oh no. Ah. Uh, yeah, I lost like all that health while trying to fight it out. Oh my goodness. It's like. I don't know. It's like really just a lot of timing in. Like, this is really like boss fight timing rather than the other stuff. Okay, here we go again. I mean, I commend the fact that it's challenging a little bit, at least. I messed up. Great, thanks, man. There we go. Oh, jeez. Nope. Okay. There we go. Yeah, I forget that I have to, like... No! Mm. Get out of there. Okay, getting out of that zone. Get out of here again. Oh no, oh son of a gun. Okay, well at least I got used to Ah, son of a gun. Come on. Let me have it. There we go. Oh great. How do I oh my god, how do I do this? There we go. Oh god. Alright, alright, oh, oh I'll take it. Oh, son of a gun. I gotta get out of this zone. Oh. No, I'm I'm just too low on that. No! Just too low again. Ah! Uh, I'm like trying to get it positioned the way to get this guy out of there. There we go, got it. Finally, jeez, that was ridiculous. <laughs> I got it at least, in like the third big try, I guess. Ha ha ha, that was a valiant attempt, Luchador. But you're in some serious trouble now, because Cactorado's just getting started. Cactorado, go body that fool. Huh? Oh, prickly hair, achievement unlocked. Fantastic. And the golden egg. The heavens be praised. We finally recovered the golden egg. Golden egg. Golden egg. Chosen one. If the... 
No! Ah! Th this is fine. It's probably just a scratch. Uh, that's bad, isn't it? Uh oh. Oh, it's a key. One down, dot, 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 achievement unlocked. The, the egg, the, the, the egg's chosen you. It gave you a piece of special key. Chosen one, perhaps you are the one who will, who will find the pieces of the key. He who assembles the special key shall open the more important door. I like how they're bowing down and this is their sign of bowing down to me, I think. We shall humbly bow before you, chosen one, but for we are not worthy of seeing you face to face. Okay, I guess. Well, at least that Cock Dorado fight was a round one only. Like, it's only one round, a one round fight. I prefer that over like a five round fight, which I think they should kind of save that for like some stuff. But I think what's interesting to me a little bit is like, this looks like a door. What's interesting to me is like, uh, there are some boss fights that do do like phase one, phase two kind of thing in phase three. I think that in the first Guacamole, the first, the first one, STCE or Gold Edition, whichever, like some of the boss fights have like phase one and phase two where they have like halfway health. Like Uwe Peck has that halfway health kind of thing that changes their phase. Um, but thankfully, this one was like not too much more than that because I think I would have been a little bit more bothered by more than what it needs to be. Oh, I guess you. Oh, it's you again. I guess that shaft doesn't work. Doesn't go in. It goes. Ah, doesn't go around. Well, buddy, you win some, you lose some. I guess you can come through here now if you want. Prepare to be blown away by the fruits of our labor. A true mechanical marvel. Okay. Uh, that's, I guess that's a mechanical mar- <laughs> Okay. Oh god, I feel- Why is it so empty and barren? That's the other question. <laughs> They're like, oh, admire our true marvel. It's like, I don't see anything here. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna end it here for now. Um, if you're wondering if I will cut a lot of the boss fight- as of this point, you probably might have seen all of it. I, didn't, I don't think I'm going to be cutting as much. <laughs> I'm going to leave my suffering as, like, the whole episode of the Cactorado uh, Cacto fight. Because I want to make sure that it was something that uh, shows how stupid I was for some parts of it. I mean, it, it, it takes a little bit of learning. It, it's a learning curve to understanding the boss patterns and stuff like that. I think I like... Okay. The one thing I will say is that I dislike the fight. But I appreciate the fight, actually, at the same time. I admire and respect the people who developed or designed that. Because that is something I like, the fact that it teaches the player, like, the pattern. Uh, and, and having the player remember the pattern and get used to the idea of what they're going to be fighting up against. A part of me didn't like it because, like, it, it utilizes wall run a little bit. And that's, like, the hard part for me is because I have to deal with the wall fly a little bit on the fly. And sometimes I might not do it well or execute it properly. And that is sometimes entirely on me sometimes. Or it might be on, like, how the, the game recognizes my controls and stuff like that. So it, it, it's a mix of feelings. But I understand that it's a really well-designed fight, I would say. Uh, and I really appreciate that fight. It's a really interesting fight. Um, but otherwise, yeah, that's it for this fight. And that's it for this episode. Uh, we will continue into El Infierno Fierno, uh, in the next episode so that we can make sure that we can progress further and see what the hell uh, Salvador is up to, what, what Salvador is up to in the hellish area here. So other than that, that's it for this episode. Roz, out.